Hi guys, welcome to Polit Sky. In today's video, we're not going to cook. Instead, we are going to do tote collection. I've been collecting totes since January, and this is one of my things to do in my road to retirement. Why is tote bag? Because tote bag is very functional for me. At work, I usually walk between our building for so many meetings. So I have to carry my laptop with me. So tote bags is very important to me in my daily life. So I have to have one tote bag per month. Started thinking about it this January of 2020. So basically I have January, February, March, April, May, and June. However, I stop at June because I just got so busy I can't go out shopping. So and I So let's start with my January tote bag. It's all in Vandalier GM. It costs $2,160 plus tax. Supple, foldable with room to spare. The all-in GM bag is an ideal travel companion. However, I use it daily at work on the month of January. It is made from classic monogram, canvas with natural cowhide leather trim and golden metal hardware. It can be carried by hand or slung over the shoulder. Here, I'm using a large bag insert to be more organized. The length is 21.7 inches, height is 15.7, and the width is 9.4 inches. The lining is textile with color gold hardware. It has zipper for closure and removable name tag. Inside, there is a zipped pocket. The strap is not removable and also not adjustable. A strap drop about 18.5 inches. This one I have is made in France. Next is my February tote bag. It is Gucci tote bag designed with rounded edges and soft shape. This tote bag is made from Gigi Supreme canvas with white leather trim and with white leather handle. I bought this tote in 2010 and I have been using this at least a month per year. This cost me, I think, 1800 plus stocks to match i also bought this gucci wallet at the same time and it cost me i think about 400 dollars plus stock this bag has a white gold tone hardware cotton linen lining there is an interior zipper and open pockets it has a leather shoulder strap with 8.7 inches drop and 20 inches length the closure is magnetic snap. The dimension is 15 inches in width, 11.2 inches in height, and 5.1 inches in depth. It is made in Italy. Next is my March tote bag collection, the Maestra Bag Bison Reed. It costs $895 US dollar. It has metal feet to protect the base. Stunning, slick, and capable of anything, the Maestra bag carry it all with eight interior compartments, including a padded sleeve that can fit up to 13 inches laptop. It has hidden zipper closure for extra security, supple, stain-resistant, micro suede interior. For wallet, I use this white leather Brighton to match. This convertible leather handbag can be worn multiple ways as a sachet, tote, crossbody, or backpack. So you've got options. Dimensions is the base width is 12.25, top width is 16 inches, height is 10.25 inches, the handle drops is 3.5 inches, and with adjustable straps of 14.5 to 20 inches. This Senrive Maestra bag is 100% made in Italy. Michael Kors Isla Ring Tote Wash Canvas is my April tote bag. The price is $248 only. This is my April tote bag. Uh, it's a Michael Kors. Materials is denim and I like this because it is very functional and versatile. 
There is lots of pockets inside. Go oh, two pockets here for cell phones. Then there's more pockets here for to put a lot of stuff. What I like about this is there's a key holder here. Casual tote bag for the month of April. This is what I use. So I bought this when we were traveling in South Dakota. So cute. It's a family of owls. This is what I use for this bag as my wallet. Michael Kors Isla Ring Shoulder Tote Wash Canvas. The price is $248 only. The color is navy washed canvas. It is a large sized bag with dimension of 16 inches width by 13 inches height and 6 inches depth. The handle length is 10 inches. It has a snap closure brushed antique brass stone exterior hardware. One interior zip pocket and eight slip pockets canvas. The trim is leather. Ella Canvas Quadrant Tote Bag is for my May tote bag collection and it's only $400. This is my May tote bag, Tory Burke tote bag. Very functional, versatile, and I love this. This is the bag that I use the longest. It has a gazette snap and magnetic bridge closure. The Ella Quadrant tote bag is made of canvas with leather window pane frame. It is ideal for everyday and getaways with a roomy interior for all of your essentials. It holds a 13 inches laptop. It has a interior zipper pocket and one slip pocket. I use this Dooney and Burke leather wallet to match my May tote bag collection. The sample I use is Limon color, but mine is brown leather color. Handles are leather with 8.4 inches drop. The height is 13.2 inches. The length is 17.3 inches and depth is 5.2 inches. Last and definitely not the least is the unboxing of my June tote bag collection. My June tote bag. I've been waiting for this. I purchased it in June. That's why I call it June tote bag. What month is today now? September. So June, July, August, September. Three months ago when I purchased it. Oh, no, no, no. Sorry. Actually, I purchased it late already. Well, let's see from the receipt. I haven't even opened it yet. I've been using my May tote bag for two months now. I should only use it for just a month. But just got busy. And here it is. Let's see when did I buy it. Oh, here's the receipt. I bought it on July 9th. Today is September 11, by the way. So that's almost two months. The cost of this is uh, 2690 plus tax of $248.83. So a total of $2,938.93. So this is my June tote bag. I rode for retirement. I need to purchase all of this before I retire for the next three years. I'm ready to open, are you? I'm excited. Untie this blue ribbon, open the box, and pull out the canvas bag. Let's see what is inside. So I've been waiting for the month of June to purchase, but I got busy. I bought it on July. Have you thought about it? Yes, I thought about it. You thought about the tote bag? Of course, I had a plan already. I had a plan already from January to December. If you're gonna go to my Facebook account, posted it, I think, in way back in January. 12 tote bags from January to, uh, to December. I have that vision. Here you go. This is what you call on the go tote bag. My June tote bag collection. It is LV on the go. GM. Fashioned from monogram giant canvas, the on the go tote bag is as striking as it is practical. A monogram reverse pattern on the sides and handles creates a stylish contrast in color and scale. With its generous capacity, shoulder straps, and iconic to run top handles, this versatile GM model is an ideal bag for everyday use. 
Lining is textile and it has an inside packet, has flat zip and double slit pockets. Let's put all my stuff inside my June tote bag. Laptop in, a sketchbook, eyeglasses case, mouse, makeup pouch, power bank, and of course my cell phone. I have this for a long time, it's a Louis Vuitton wallet, so it match. I will use this for a month. So let's put that here and I'm good to go. On the go, tote bag has 16.1 inches length, 13.4 inches height, and 7.5 inches width. Here's the view from the top to look how organized it is from the inside. Louis Vuitton On The Go GM has a gold color hardware and it has a double handle. I love my June tote bag collection because it is simple yet classy, it's stylish and functional, versatile and durable. It can be matched with any color and clothing and I'm super excited to use this in this coming month. With the concept of collecting 12 tote bags, one tote bag per month to use, that means I only got to use each bag per month per year. With the goal of using these bags forever, timeless design is the key to purchase, to last for a long time. And with that, thanks for watching and see you on my next collections, the July to December tote bag collection.